Uh, Gators do start spring practice. Uh, they are in shells for these first couple practices. Or they're just in helmets for the first couple practices. Um, Nick, give us a, a little bit of the uh, the highlights. Obviously, DJ Lagway uh, making it onto the timeline made for some uh, outstanding lies to be spewed. Uh, everybody's ready for an undefeated season. So, Nick, what can you give us from the football field? Yeah, it's in, like I get it. Like uh, I think DJ is a court a franchise type quarterback so i get it but like i'm more interested in miles graham honestly because i think miles graham can be a freshman that like can start but you know dj lagway will uh get the clicks as mm. they say um i was interested in the numbers because I, I i talked to montrell who didn't seem to have much interest in changing his number i think he's worn two i think he even wore two at, at louisiana um i was like man what numbers dj gonna wear he he uh, couldn't make money off of his name, image, and likeness in Texas, but there was a lot of DL2 gear that I'd seen, you know, him and his family wearing. Mm. I might have been collecting cobwebs. So Trell gets the one. Uh, Justice Boone gets one. DJ gets to slide into his uh, his normal two. Um, and, and I want to say this with it's no shade towards the guys in number one, um, but like this coaching staff doesn't care sure. or subscribe to the I history that, that you have they don't I, I, i'm telling no, you telling you point no, blank period they don't they don't care who's in number one okay i think it's not i think it's by design that ricky pearsall got it uh prince he asked for kneeling. It. Yeah, oh, that's what he i'm saying these are guys that are considered better players on the team these aren't just like bum guys or a random freshmen that are getting it. these are guys that we kind of expecting a lot from while they may not, or they may, you know, throwing out that notion that they don't care about the number one, I don't think it's a coincidence that Ricky Pearsall and Umi Neelan got it. Got it. Do that? Do I think both deserved it? No, I don't think Prince Lee lived up to the hype of number one. Ricky did. Um, this year, I thought maybe Trey Wilson would get. I know a lot of people think he wants to stay in that three. We'll see in the future. Uh, but I expected um, Trey Wilson to get it. But Montreal arguably is the leader of the offense. Or one of the top leaders on the offense could be one of our best offensive players. And you look at Justice Boom, he takes up for Prince Umi Neelan, who left, probably going to be our best edge rusher. Uh, he gets it. We'll see if they both live up to the hype of it. But I'm not buying that, that they don't care about it or they don't put any emphasis on it. There's something there. I don't think these players are getting in and gravitating towards it for no reason. We'll just see, like, sometimes you just got to shelf number one. If, if if you don't have him on offensive defense, it's okay. Just leave it on the shelf until to him arrive. Yeah, yeah. They they don't care. Yeah, like I I agree with you. Like, hey, if we don't have a guy that should be like Dan Mullen, came out and said like, hey, if you want to wear that number, you have to be a baller. I think this staff, if you ask for it and it's available, they'll just give it to you. That's fine. Sure. It's just to them, it's just a number. <laughs> They're not looking at. What's the history of these numbers? And and to a degree, like Steve Spurrier didn't subscribe to that. He came back to Florida and was like, why can't I give a player number 11? They're like, oh, that's your number. You won the Heisman, retired it. And he's like, no, 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 that's stupid. We're unretiring numbers. Um, Get off my but like Graham Mertz, Graham Mertz didn't want number 15. They just gave it to him. And when he got here, I'm like, can we stop giving – quarterbacks 15 they just gave it to him so okay Graham Merce who's a veteran guy transferring over started at Wisconsin had didn't care what number he was getting I think there's some strategy behind giving him 15 I don't think that's just coincidental it's a legendary number at the stop university giving guys, by a quarterback. stop giving quarterbacks Tim Tebow's number because like, like Dan what do you think 15 you think is Tim Tebow's number 15? at the University of Florida forever could you they just give you a number any... say you're the starting quarterback could they just give you a number Nick yeah, I'm on 69. Hammy, give me that number. <laughs> no, yeah, you're going to be like, ridiculous. You're, you're going to have a preference to a number. I don't think like Graham Mertz showed Graham up. Mertz has like, worn what? number five his whole life. Yeah. Would have liked number five. And they're like, who was number five player? on the team last year? Do we have number five on offense? Uh, Naquan Wright was five. That was in 21, though. Right. Yeah, I don't know if he had a number five on the roster. Maybe, you know, it's also it's signaling a, a turning of the page for him. Right. 